but thou shalt call thy walls what? And thy gates what? Psalm 87 verse number 2. Yes, go. The Lord loved what? The gates of Zion. The gates. Now when you read John chapter number 10, don't, don't forget it. Jesus was talking and Jesus said, he is the door. Are we there? So we can say that Jesus is the gate of Zion. And the Lord loved the gates of Zion. And we read right there that praise is the gate. Oh, come on. Are we here? Psalm 100 verse number 2 and 4. What does it say? Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with what? With singing. Uh Uh-huh. 4. Enter into his gates with and into his cause with and then continue. Hello. Church, are we here? I strongly believe and listen to this. God allowed this thing to happen so what the devil was doing in heaven now God has given us we believers that power that anytime we use praise and worship thanksgiving we administer punishment unto the devil we paralyze him now do you know that the devil hates praises I'm here to tell you he hates praises because you see he does not understand I'm afflicting you things are hard you need to be cursing God you need to be annoyed you need to oh come on are we here no 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 am I having witnesses here and then all of a sudden he will see you smiling he will see you praising God he will see you magnifying God what do you think it is when you are loggerheads you are loggerheads with somebody alright and the fellow keeps annoying you keeps annoying, and then you don't mind the fellow you rather smile and you rather at times you know clap your hands <laughs> you know, it's irritating I'm doing something to you in order to fight with you and all that you are just ridiculing me come on when we enter into praise we ridicule the devil oh are you there we make him feel stupid and yes he is that is why you and I must know this listen to me the church of Jesus Christ I'm saying that apart from prayer please we must add praise power and worship because you see let me let me let me let me say this what happens when you are fasted you have prayed which we need to be doing it we need to be intensifying our prayer lives because the days are evil come on are we here after praying and fasting and doing all that all right you are waiting for your answers to happen so the duration the time in between you waiting what do you do that is where the enemy comes in and then tries to oh this thing you see you are fast at all my marriage was, but the thing is not coming on so 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 you become frustrated you become agitated you become some kind of way. When they ask you to even come to church, grab hey, church in the aqua. Hey, you have buttons now. Nah. But nothing is happening. And if you don't take time, that is where now you begin to nullify your praise. Because you see, death and life are in the world. And they that love it will do it. So in between, when the promises have not come, Whilst you are waiting, come on, enter into praise. Put on the garment of praise for the spirit of what? Heaviness, defeat. And when you begin to bless God, when the situations are rough, and then you say, Oh, be lifted. 
above oh yeah 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 we paralyzed the devil hates praises you can never be a joyful believer and you'll be defeated I'm telling you come on. are we here all right Proverbs chapter number 15 verse number 13 Proverbs 15 13 what does it say come on can we already go uh-huh Oh, did you, did, you, did you see that? He said that what? Oh, come on. He said what? And what is a merry heart? A merry heart. You are always joyful. You are always smiling. In the <laughs> face of adversities, <laughs> the Bible said, thou shalt laugh. Ah, come on. Something good is about to happen to you. Oh, let me say this. The glory of the Lord, the Bible said, will fill the earth as the waters cover the what? I keep saying this and I want you to know. Look at COVID. It became pandemic, right? I'm telling you, the glory of God will become more pandemic than COVID. The glory, oh my, my you see, Many good things are about to take place. In fact, they have started. Let those who have eyes, let those who have ears, let them see and let them hear. There is a sound that is coming to the body of Christ. A sound of rejoicing. A sound of victory. As we enter into our prayer closets, as we begin to roar. Come on. We do not have to be disturbed. A merry heart. Do what? what? Good like what? Okay, that's a different one, right? Okay, Proverbs 17. I think this is 1722. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, okay. This is what I... Yeah, all right. I, I told you I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm. <laughs> The walking Bible because I love that. <laughs> now, look at that. Can we already go? And you see, Bishop, one of the things that I honestly detest and I don't like when I see Christians being moody, morose, all the time, I see the God that we serve is not alive. I see that the God that we serve hmm, is someone who oh come on we are praising Jesus and he is the alpha and what the beginning and what and what again the first and what so what again no I said what again no what again ah he holds the whole well by the word of his power he's right there what can't he do but you and I need to create this atmosphere and understand some of them you know it I don't want to act 16 is right there the great apostle 
they were thrown into the prison. In the most court over there. Their, 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 their levels. Hands and everything was chained. He had every reason to complain and to whine and to talk and to curse God. But then the Bible said after prayer. Say after prayer. So you see every time prayer goes after prayer Paul told Silas Hey! Silas are you there? And I'm sure Silas will also respond. Hey Paul we are here. I am here. And then I could just see them. You know what the Bible said? They started singing what? Praises. So you see the chains and all those things uh, they got weakened while they were praying but when they entered into the power zone the praise then what happened all the chains and everything went come on am I talking to you look at Exodus 15 verse number 11 don't worry come on we are moving on Last scripture Exodus 15 11 what does it say who is like unto thee what oh lord what 